Anyway, right, this, this, the UK carrier system. We have two systems. Uh, one is now remotely is an AC-1. Yuck. Which William knows more about than I do. <laughs> That's absolutely <laughs> One called an AC-9, which we both know about. And the one uh, in, in use mostly is an AC-9. Uh, that is, uh, it's, it's like a sort of uh, re re uh, reverse 2600 in a way. Uh, a clear carrier, i.e. a carrier carrying no traffic, is silent. Um, to pick up a trunk, you give a very short burst of 2280 uh, on a particular trunk. Uh, the number is then sent out at uh, 10 pulses per second, or 10 bursts, 2280 a second, uh, as per normal. Uh, supervision is a backward uh, transmission of 100 milliseconds of 2280. Hmm. And the same thing is also uh, the same thing also happens on a, on a backward clear. There's no difference between a between a forward clear, backward clear, or anything else. That's what messes. That's why the supervision gets messed up when you blow a number off by 2280. Right. You blow a number off by 2280, your supervision starts going backwards. What happens if you blow it blow it off again? It's still backwards. It's still backwards because a release guard is what? What's a release guard? 200 milliseconds. Uh, about 200 milliseconds. And that's the reason. Yeah, and you can't clear forward once you your call subscribers answer because you get split. Okay, I, I dig. You get split in about 20 milliseconds, very quickly. Wow. If you if you call a number up, blow it off. Uh, you have then you have then supervised the line. You can then fuck about all day, but the second that the, the subscriber you call answers, uh, this is exchange sees that as unsupervision, yeah. Right. And you then start timing out. So you're quite safe while you're dialing, but the second the guy you've called picks up his phone, you then start your timeout. Unless he can send you 100 milliseconds. But if he replaces his phone every three minutes, what happens when you out? call into the states and blow 2600? Right. If you do it silently enough, you get to drop back onto the circuit. Hey, Bill. Yeah. Hey, um, has hasn't Derek called called us up at the school before? Because I know his voice sounds very familiar. Yes, he has. Ah, then I have spoken to him then. Aha. Uh -huh. Did you pick up the uh, nine six nine six sometime? Right. Right. I'm Keith. You're Keith. Hi. 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 You're at home, Keith. Yes, I am. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to be in New York on Monday, but this is the bad idea to come to the school. Uh, I very don't know. bad after 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 a recent. Well, yeah, well, I, I, well, we're it's allowed a, like one visitor a year, and I think we've had ours. I could arrive as an English country gentleman; they'd never have a difference. <laughs> well, how about cousin from Shrewsbury? Well, if you say you know me, you can get in pretty easy. I get pretty good, play a little good politics with the boss all the time, anyway. Uh huh. So, well, what I will do is I will I, I will be arriving at a private number in New York, which I shall give to you when I get there. Very good. Very good. Uh, it's on. It's on two six zero. Uh huh. Two six zero. Two six zero. Two six zero is a funny exchange bill. It's brand new. What kind of office? What is it? Yeah, I think it's one crossbar. Yeah. Where at? Uh, hold on a second. I'll look it up. <laughs> yes. All right. <laughs> Always give him a lecture, Bill. What? Always giving him a lecture. Never write anything down. What? I'm not, I'm sorry, I shouldn't use that. Ooh. Star Diamond, Star Diamond. <laughs> this is a recording. Diamond 3, Diamond 3. <laughs> hey, did, 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 did anybody ever give you that recording that sounds like a parrot? That sounds like a what? Uh, there's a recording in 714 that can only be a parrot. What's the number? The mark has got it. It's 794 It's 714794, if I remember rightly. Yeah, I have that number. It's just your call did not go through, but it, it, it is unmistakably a pirate. <laughs> what does it say? Just your call did not go through, your call did not go through, your call did not go through? I'm sorry, your call did not go through. I'm sorry. It's completely crazy. Mark gave it to me. I love the 914 recordings because, like, they, they apparently they go part way and then they stop going the rest of the way, and all of a sudden you just hear. <laughs> and it's great. Oh, is it Type 4 off the I don't know what it is. I, I, don't, I really wonder. I, I'm beginning to think they use a, a weirdo type record system. Did you know that White Plains is a giant uh, low transmission conference? Give me that. <laughs> what? Oh, sorry about that. What are you talking about? No, no it's just that the, cross, the crosswires you get on White Plains are really bad. Oh. It's disgusting. Yeah, there is a lot of cross talk in that area. You know what's really gross about some of these recordings I've heard? What? There, for a while up in uh, Newfoundland, when he dialed in the day, you got that 5141 recording? Yeah. 
But it was, it, you know, the message is in one language, in English, and then goes in French. Yeah, we're switching in the middle. Yeah. Right. I, I have a thing now, uh, Are you familiar with those real screw 800 recordings? Uh, which ones? The 4 8 test recordings. Oh, yes, yeah. 5 4 8, I think it is. Hey, John? Right. Yeah. John, if you want to hear an unusual English speaking clock. Sure. I'll give you an interesting reading. Bill, Bill, Bill probably knows this one. Um, what's the best way? Come up, country code 44. <laughs>
Over, 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 to, over, to, over to the mainland uh, France. <laughs> you mean to tell me that the diameter of the cable is about the same as the diameter of the island? Well, uh, but yeah, well, it's a very tiny place. <laughs> and I went there with a kid one. It's kind of a strange tradition. Did you know that the heat of the meat, the heat of the meat is proportional to the mass of the ass? The angle of, no, I'm sorry. The angle of the dangle is proportional to the heat of the meat if the mass of the ass is kept constant. Well, I don't know. The proportion of the mass what was that again? Get then tight. Uh, it's quite all right. If he had not been able to shock, then we might have been able to understand what he said. Right. The product of the poison is in the vessel with the pestle, with the cycle and the dragon. I believe it's true. Stun of a gun. Beat him on that one. Good. Okay, I give up. To the right. I equals three point one four one five nine two six five three five eight nine seven nine three two three eight four six two four six two. Seven nine five two eight eight four one nine seven one six nine three nine three seven five one zero five eight two one nine seven four nine two four five nine two three nine uh <coughs> oh seven eight one six four oh six two eight six two eight nine and eight six two eight oh three four eight two five three four two one one seven oh six seven nine. You should be like Jabberwocky. I like that better. Oh, really? Yes. Sorry, I didn't catch that. <laughs> I just said that pi equals three point one four one five nine two six five three five eight nine seven nine three two three eight four six two six four three three eight three two seven nine five oh two eight eight four one nine seven one six nine three nine three seven five one oh five eight two oh nine seven four nine four four five nine two three oh seven eight one six four oh six two eight six two eight nine and eight six two eight oh three four eight two five three four two and one seven oh six seven nine. Could you repeat that after the decimal point? I didn't get that. Yeah, I think you're breaking up real. <laughs> Now I can slow that down one speed, isolate each digit, and then put them back, put it back together, and maybe I can copy it. Jabberwocky, that's more creative, I think. Hey, speaking of that, hey, um, Derek. Yeah. Where in the devil is the island of uh, the Isle of Man? The Isle of Man is off the coast of Liverpool. I thought he was going to say Manhattan. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything resembling an exchange on it? Yes, there is. And you access it with, hang on a minute, and I'll tell you how to get there. I think it's 624 after the country code. That gives you the main group switching center. What a funny number, 624. It is 624, <laughs> that's a funny name, motherfucker. <laughs> Bill will tell you why it's 624. Well, 624, that's right. By the way, I visited the office in Canterbury. Yeah. I, I went through that office, too. What's that like? Oh, it's just a stepper. <coughs> I hope you took a VIS. Uh, the AIS? VIS. What's that? It's a little file that the operator has next to it. Oh, I didn't get a chance to look in it, no. Nah. Well, you should have taken it. Never mind, looked in it. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah, I'll show you one when I come over. <coughs> oh, yeah, those are where it's got all the codes. That's right. I'll show, I'll show you the one for the London area. It gives all the Kingsway and Friday codes for England and uh, UK. Oh, wow. There's about 2,000 of them. Ooh. Each area has their own code book. Yeah. Every exchange has got its own book. Oh, my God. There are, there are, you wouldn't believe the complexity of the English routing system. I believe it. Yeah, Bill, Bill knows a lot about it. It's a I think I can, I can get, I can get a, I can get a fair understanding of how it works. He stacked British tandems. Because I've stacked British tandems. I cannot believe how long it took for all that crap to disengage. It takes quite a time, doesn't it? I could not believe it. The most amusing ones are the AC ones. Oh yeah. Oh, those those beep beep tones you get, huh? Where it goes beep beep that. No, that's, that's, that's AC-9. The AC-1 goes... Like that. Oh, I didn't hear those. First, um... Did I go for any AC-9s, Bill? I mean, AC-1s? Uh, yes. You went from what, Liverpool to Kingsway. Which Liverpool to Kingsway. You know them. Uh, so well, I didn't... You can hear a very strange whining noise on them. It's very faint, but very characteristic of an AC-1. Very pleasant noise. Now, uh, I gotta ask, have to ask you, when you're dialing all that crap, you have to die, you have to wait for each digit to get pulse repeated. Yeah, uh, there's the storing everywhere. Huh? Every, every 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 exchange has storage. Hey, Mark. Oh, so I can just sort of dial slow, right? But not. I don't have to wait for all those digits to get absorbed, do I? No, no. There's no limit to the amount you can store. So I can just keep dialing, right? But sure. but dial slowly, right? Don't dial too quickly, right? 
Oh, okay. Hey, Mark? Yeah. Yeah. You can tell them normal speed. But slightly slower than normal speed. Hey, Mark? Yeah. You get any new jingles lately? Nope. No? Oh, my God. What's the matter, man? My mailing list, I guess, has been dropped. Bill? Yeah. I'll try that for... Uh, I'll have to drop. I'll have to catch a plane and not to this in the future. I'll try that 404 number now. Okay. Good. Drop from the mailing list. We're back? Alright. How come you would drop from the mailing list? I don't know. No, I should be getting something shortly. I'm gonna go. Get walk up. Hi, ho. Hey, does anybody find out what 260 is? New York? Yeah, 212260. Busy, but. Still busy? Yeah. That's boring. Never mind. Where is 260, do you know? Somewhere in New York. Um, yeah. I covered that. Anyway, gentlemen, I'm off to book my airplane, and I'll see you all very soon. Very good. Okay, Derek. I hope. Okay, John, who have we got, Mark? Okay, Derek. Anytime uh, you want to get up on the cons, just give me a call, Derek. Okay, we'll do. Okay, Derek, this and, is And, uh, and when you get to New York, give me a call. Sure, I'll, I'll speak to everybody. I'll be in a nice little private number tucked away. Okay, okay. Derek, this is Keith, and, you know... When you get in touch with Bill over there at the school, we'll, I'll give you a shout also, because we're in the same dormitory. Now. I'll okay. give you a call on 9696 on Monday evening. Right. And when Ray or myself uh, grabs the conference, we'll, we'll be sure to give you a call at that number. Beautiful. Uh, when, I get to, when I get to New York, I'll give you the private number, but I won't do it now because I don't trust Wood Street. Bill will tell you about that. Very good. Okay. Fair okay, Derek, so... Bill will explain all. Okay, catch you all When you get in touch with us in New York, I'll say hello, man. All right, keep well, everybody. All right, take care. You too. Stay sure. clear. Bye-bye. Right. Yeah, drop me somebody. Just hang up. Okay. Uh, Bill? Yeah. What's this Wood Street he was talking about? Wood Street is the central office. Might or might not be going through how it's happening, but it's sealed. In other words, the central office has been giving him hassle? Right. Oh, do they know about him? Well, they have a habit of monitoring him in the trunk. <coughs> they have been monitoring him? No, they have a habit of monitoring overseas in the trunk. Oh, they're the ones that monitor the overseas. Right. Oh, I see. That's funny. I'm sitting here smoking an English tobacco. How about that? Well, I can think of a heck of a lot better stuff to smoke, Keith. Well, so could, so could I.